capital of the United Arab Emirates, Abu Dhabi is a well-ordered, industrious city with a pretty waterside location. First inhabited by the nomadic Bani Yas tribe in 1760, the settlement remained a small fishing village until oil was discovered. The revenues transformed Abu Dhabi into the modern city of today, a bustling center of government and business. With a coastline rimmed by beaches, Abu Dhabi is one of the best places to visit in the UAE to combine sun and sand with a city break. The Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque and Louvre Abu Dhabi are the major tourist attractions, though, with kayaking trips amid the eastern mangroves and the desert dune landscapes of Lewa Oasis within day-tripping distance, there are plenty of adventures and things to do on the city's doorstep. Plan your stay with our list of the top attractions and things to do in Abu Dhabi. Number 10. Desert Dunes The most popular day trip or overnight trip from Abu Dhabi city is a desert safari to the south of the Emirate of Abu Dhabi, either to the beautiful Liwa Oasis, which lays right on the edge of the empty quarter, or to the Al Khatim Desert near Al Ain. The empty quarter desert contains the largest sand dunes in the world, and the dunes of both areas are a fantastic playground for anyone who wants to ride dune buggies, try sandboarding, go camel trekking, or simply soak up the vast star-strewn desert sky after dark at a desert camp. Most trips include stops to visit a camel farm and offer a taste of traditional desert life, as well as heading into the dunes themselves. The evening desert safari is a great option for visitors with only a short time to spare, offering a six-hour tour into the Emirates desert environs. Visitors are taken on a 4x4 tour of the Deniscape before settling down for dinner at a desert camp, with traditional tanura and belly dancing entertainment provided. Once at camp, guests can choose from a host of complimentary activities, such as sandboarding and camel rides. All transport, with pickup and drop-off from Abu Dhabi hotels, and food is included. Number 9. Formula 1 at the Yas Marina Circuit. Abu Dhabi's Formula One Grand Prix, which takes place in November, is the city's big annual event and is held at Yas Marina Circuit on Yas Island. If you're not in town for the racing, you can still experience some of that Formula One glamour year-round. There are regular guided tours of the circuit, including visits to the pits, grandstand, and podium for Formula One fans who want to see the track and get a behind-the-scenes look at the circuit. For speed fans, though, Yas Marina Circuit is where you can book a variety of drive experiences, as either the driver or passenger in various styles of racing car, on the Formula 1 track itself. If you just want to walk, or run, or cycle, on the track, every Tuesday and Saturday night the circuit is opened up for anyone who wants to use the track for exercise, and entry is free. Number 8. Warner Bros World Yas Island's latest theme park addition, Warner Bros World is dedicated to its cartoon, movie, and comic book heroes and villains, with all rides based around these characters. With six lands, all captured under one roof, the entire theme park is inside and air-conditioned, this is one of the best places to visit for families. There are rides suitable for tots to teens. Bedrock and Cartoon Junction are specifically set up for little ones, while Gotham City and Metropolis are home to some of the big hitter highlight rides, which combine 4D interactive content with roller coaster style thrills and spills. Number 7. Soak up the sun on Yas Island. Yas Beach on Yas Island is a popular choice for a full day at the beach. Day passes here grant beachgoers access to a wealth of facilities that will please both families looking for an easygoing beach day and groups of friends seeking a fun-filled beach experience. 
There are cafes, restaurants, and food kiosks on site offering a range of cuisines. A large swimming pool area with cabanas for rent, plenty of sun loungers and shades for lazing on the sand, and more lounging areas of the sand. Yas Beach's water sports offices offer a range of rental equipment for active visitors, including kayaks, and lifeguards are on duty throughout the day. Number 6. See the city from the water on a cruise. For the best views of Abu Dhabi's glittering skyscrapers, you need to head out onto the water. The views of the high-rises are quite spectacular as you sail out from the marina. Several different operators run tours for all types of budgets. During the day, island hopping tours are very popular and provide a relaxing sightseeing option. They include some beach and snorkeling time on various islands within the bay. For city views, though, head out on a sunset or evening dinner tour so that you can see the city lights flicker into action as dusk sets over the city. There are also pearl tours, where you head out into the mangroves area in a small dhow and learn about Abu Dhabi's pearl diving heritage. Number 5. Ferrari World This branded theme park brings the thrill of Formula 1 racing to Abu Dhabi and is one of the city's top things to do for adrenaline seekers and families alike. Small children can test out newly learned driving skills on the junior GT track, while speed junkies can buckle up and ride the Flying Aces roller coaster, which clocks up speeds of 120 km per hour on a 52-meter loop, the tallest in the world. There's also a collection of Ferrari's cars, with models dating back to 1947, and a Ferrari factory tour and Ferrari knowledge game show for true car nerds. Number 4. Sardia Island Sandy Shaw Sardia Island is one of Abu Dhabi's top sunseeker destinations. Sardia Beach is a long strip of white sand on the island's western shore, with a small admission fee for beachgoers. It has excellent facilities, including on-duty lifeguards, a cafe for refreshments, and plenty of sun lounges and shades. For active sun seekers, you can rent kayaks and windsurfing equipment on the beach. The beach is backed by a rim of protected dunes where hawksbill turtles nest. Access to the beach is on a raised wooden boardwalk so that this area is not disturbed. If you want a more luxurious day on the sand, head farther north along Sardia Island's coast to the private Sardia Beach Club. A day pass grants you access to this exclusive beach strip with all its facilities, including a pool, restaurants, and various lounge areas. Number 3. Kayak Abu Dhabi's Eastern Mangroves To see a different side of Abu Dhabi's steel and glass exterior, head into the mangrove forests that still ring the islands along the shore surrounding the city. There's a bundle of kayaking tours available for all levels of experience and age, ranging from 1.5 hours to 3 hours of paddling. The eco-tour allows you to understand the important ecology of mangroves, as well as explore these beautiful last remnants of the city's forests. Another interesting thing to do for a really special experience, is to sign up for night tours and discover the mangroves by gliding through the waters after dark. Number 2. Louvre Abu Dhabi The Middle East's most spectacular museum, Louvre Abu Dhabi traces the entire history of humanity's artistic achievements, from the Neolithic right up to the current day. The wealth and diversity of art on display, from ancient Egyptian statuary to famous paintings by Picasso, is mind-boggling, while the museum's contemporary architecture, with its galleries gathered under a vast silver dome, is a reason to visit in itself. As well as the permanent collection, which runs over 12 galleries, several major temporary exhibitions are staged each year. 
The Louvre is the first of three planned major museums to open on Sardia Island, which is set to become the cultural heartbeat of Abu Dhabi in the coming years. Number 1. Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque Clad in white marble, the B. Beautiful and absolutely mammoth Sheikh Zayed Grand Mosque is Abu Dhabi's landmark building and by far the most popular sightseeing attraction in the city. The mosque fuses Mameluke, Ottoman, and Fatimid design elements to create a harmonious and thoroughly modern mosque that celebrates Islamic architecture. Artisans used glasswork, mosaic tiling, and intricate carvings to spectacular effect on both the interior and exterior. It was opened in 2007 after nearly 20 years of construction. Able to hold 40,000 worshippers, it is the biggest mosque in the United Arab Emirates, and like the Sheikh Zayed Mosque in Fujaira, the UAE's second biggest mosque, it is dedicated to the late Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan Al Nahyan. Do subscribe Scoop Buddy for more such videos.